This is the resting place of Iskramor, and its most trusted generals. You should be cautious. Kodlak was right. I let vengeance rule my heart. I regret nothing of what we did at Driftshade. But I can't go any further with my mind fogged or my heart grieved. The original companions, their finest warriors, rest with Isgramor. You'll have to prove yourselves to them. It's not that you're intruding. I'd wager they've actually expected us. They just want to be sure that you're worthy. Be ready for an honorable battle. Return Wuthra to Isgramor. It should open the way. There's a sense of evil about this place. All right, then. You stand within the sacred tomb of Isgrimor himself, Kaiden. I believe you understand and appreciate the reverence this moment deserves. Aye, Ela. I do. Truth is, though. I do not feel that one such as I, just a man and not even a companion, is worthy to be here in such a sacred place. You are wrong, Kaiden. You are not a companion, tis true. But you are not just a man to us either. You are our brother. You are here to stand as one with us, here in our most holy of holies, and be united in our sworn oath for Kodlak. We would have it no other way. You are our brother in arms, our brother by choice, our brother in spirit. You are welcome here as one of us. We need you, brother. I am honored, beyond what I can say with words. I will see this through. I swear it to you. I swear it on my mother's blade. For Kodlak! For Kodlak. There are dead eyes watching us. I can feel them. Hey, you. I understand some of what he must be going through. I've done things in my life out of anger that I wasn't proud of. But in time, he'll realize there's no one to be angry at but himself. I will never leave your side. The smell of spiders is strong here. I wonder how many there are. Not enough, probably. The evil in this place must be rooted out. <laughs> Easy. Problem solved. All oh, the living <laughs> shall fall. Ah! I will return! Fucking bastard. You can never choose more! Oh, what the fuck? What a fight! Aye. No. It really doesn't bother me. You can tie me down, Dragonborn, and in any way you like. I can't go any further, Shield Sister. Ever since Dustman's Cairn, the big crawly ones have been too much for me. Everyone has his weakness, and this one is mine. I'm not proud, but I will stay back with Vilkas. Give my regards to Ysgrimor. Kaiden, I thought I could do this. I can't, brother. 
The spiders. I'm going to tell her. Explain why I can't go further. Vargas, don't you worry yourself about it. You wait here, and keep an eye out for trouble. I've got your back on this. I appreciate that, little brother. This should be good. Uh, fucking tastic. <laughs> Spider. Pathetic existences. Don't do that. How did they find us? And you can fuck us right no off. This place is a little grim. But it is an honor to be here. For Kodlak. I am a companion of a companion fighting dead companions. This is a very strange day. I'm wondering why we have stopped. Danger lies ahead. Keep your eyes open. What was that? Come you on. are not welcome to some of you. A moment of fight. Please fight harder. Hell yeah! I'm okay. Don't waste your magic. I'm you done need beast. a few more arrows in you. I hope we do not let Kudlak down. You are not welcome here. Die! You pathetic mortal! I am no better than you. So the rain. Mr. <laughs> Dragonfly says that was an impressive kill. My friend, wait for me. The sooner we see the sky again, the better. Greetings, Shield Sister. Of course, my fellow Harbingers and I have been warming ourselves here, trying to evade hearsay. You see only me because your heart knows only me as the Companion's leader. I'd wager old Vignar could see half a dozen of my predecessors. And I see them all. The ones in Sovengard, the ones trapped with me in Hearsay's realm. And they all see me. You've brought honor to the name of the Companions. We won't soon forget it. Did he now? I can only hope. You still have the Witch's heads. Excellent. Throw one of them into the fire. It will release their magic. For me, at least. I'm always at your service. Day or night. With you huh? all the way. Thought I heard something. Ah. Come on, let's put up a fight. No sign of them. Greetings, Shield Sister. And so slain the beast inside of me. 
I thank you for this gift. The other Harbingers remain trapped by hearsay. Perhaps from Sovngarde, the heroes of old can join me in their rescue. The harrowing of the hunting grounds. It would be a battle of such triumph. And perhaps someday, you'll join us in that battle. But for today, return to your vessel. Triumph in your victory. And lead the companions to further glory. Did I hear right? Did he say you were to lead the companions? You've earned the right. Your strength and honor are apparent to all. And it's my honor to be first to address you as Harbinger. Let's go tell the others. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. Leader of the Companions? Congratulations, my friend. To be chosen for such a task is a great honor. We are done here, and I, I am sure you will. But he I chose you for a reason. Never forget that. Anyway, was there something else you wanted to talk about? If you should die down here, do not worry. I will drag your body out. We wouldn't want you roaming around here for eternity. Do you have guidance for me, Harbinger? Something on your mind? Hell of a title. You're going to do Yisgrimor proud. <laughs> Aye? So long as your head still fits inside the mead hall. Come here, and let me worship you. I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Perhaps we can hunt together someday. Don't let them intimidate you, sister. We both know how to keep our heads, while the men let their hearts rule. It's good to have another quick-eyed shield sister in the hall. Come to me with any troubles. Out with it. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. He's not a werewolf anymore? Even dead? This is a good thing. Oh, you don't have to worry about any problems from me. I do what I'm told. Congratulations. I go where my brother goes. I think he wants to look around some more. All right then. Vilkas said you're the new Codlac. I don't know what that means, but you seem honorable, so that's good. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Yes, you brought honor to him, even after his death. A worthy outcome for a worthy warrior. If you had told me a few months ago that some outsider I had never heard of would lead the companions, I might have slit your throat. But I've seen what you can do. And heard of the love that Kadlak had for you. The trust. Let's hope you can show that his heart was not deceived. Good luck, my friend. Not right now. I'm going to look at some of these carvings. I wonder if Ysgramor ever set foot here while he was alive. But you don't have to stay if you don't want to. I'll see you back at the Orvasker. Stories to tell the others, eh? Aye. You look tense. What's next? Well, my love, that's all over and I'm bloody relieved for it. Now we need to relax, eat, drink and be merry and celebrate another job well done. What's on your mind, love? 
I really want to kiss you right now. <laughs>